Cheers and welcome to Chicago Reacts. My name is Lauren and today I'm going to be look at, looking at Let's Game It Out. This video is how I made $3,262,221,056 ruining the real estate market. So uh, let's go. I'm all for the real estate market being destroyed because I'm never going to buy a house anyway. Um, and landlords should just go away and stop being landlords. I'm just saying, if your holy, only job is to make other people pay you money to do basically nothing, that's not a job. I'm just saying. Because everybody else has to have a job to, in order to pay the landlords. So if you got another job and your landlord, that's, that's something a little bit different. That is different. But there are people out there whose only job is being a landlord. F that. Anyway, this is a rant over. Let's begin! Hey there, it's Josh. Welcome back to Let's Hi, Game Josh. It Out. We're checking out a state agent simulator. Developers, thank you for the early key. For closed beta, just where we want it. Somewhere between functional and highly silly. And with all this realty fun to be had, I think we're gonna have plenty to do on our plate. And hey, speaking of plates, let me tell you about today's sponsor, Displate. That's that site with the metal posters. So I've known about oh, Displate cool. for a long time. Like, I've heard a lot of other creators talk about them. So I was like, yeah, sure, let's finally check them out. And I gotta say, I'm actually quite impressed with a quality. So basically, Displate is a metal poster. Sturdy, durable, pretty light, and comes with a magnet for really easy mounting to a wall. No drilling or nails required. And yes, the magnets work great when you place them like a sane person. And there's an unbelievable amount of designs you can choose from. Like, they told me there's over a million designs to browse through, which means I'm pretty oh, sure there wow. really is something for everyone. From branded stuff from all kinds of movies, all kinds of games, tons of pop culture, memes, you name it. Like, the poster I've been showing off is from the game rust, which looks great on the matte finish. But also, I picked up some cool sciency stuff, like this diagram of a black hole. And it contrasts really well to these vintage-style travel posters of national parks. Or even this duck. Yep, this duck is on a metal poster. And they're doing a Black Friday sale. So if this oh, sounds dude. neat to you, use my linky in the description to head on over to Displate, or use the code LGIO at checkout to get discounts that look a little something like this. Oh, and also, they deliver worldwide in like four to five business days. So thanks again to Displate for sponsoring okay first um, things first really, we have to pick our really quick though before we get into this i'm definitely going to the link in the description i'm just keeping Character. it up Let's so that i have it for later because i'm gonna buy something off that i you know like almost guarantee you half of the christmas gifts i get for people this year are gonna be that Let's see which one of these losers do we want to be i think we're gonna go with david here because he was the only one dumb enough to not wear something with a collar oh good we can and his eyes are crossed. Like, why Why are his... Like, everyone else is staring directly into your soul like they're gonna eat it. And he's just being like... A silly boot. He's being a silly goose. Rename them. Dr. Idiot. PhD. Excellent. And now Good. next we have to, what? Select our wife. Oh no. Buckle up. We're in for a ride. We're gonna pick Amelia because I don't know what the hell else to do here. And we're gonna rename her to, ah! Yeah, that'll do. <laughs> okay, thank God the game didn't have any more surprises for us. Ah, and here we are in our sadness attic. I like that the first tutorial prompt is open the suitcase and take the money. You heard the tutorial game. Accept your sweet bribe. Otherwise, how are we supposed to become real estate millionaires? Okay, now we have $41,000. Why 41? Probably could have gotten an even number in there if you had just stacked like an adult. And nice right? to see our guys living up to his earth tone potential with matching <laughs> cargo tactical pants and what looks to be maybe hiking boots. Excellent, and here's our workspace. Amazing MacBook, portrait of my wife. Where is the wife? Oh my God. Oh God, why? Oh no. Oh goodness. And the shadow is awful. What is she doing? That's horrifying. <laughs> like... Mm, you know what? I'm gonna go with no thanks on that one. Anyway. Oh, there she is. Hello. Happy Monday morning to you. <laughs> oh, are you even alive? Are you doing okay? Do you have a hair texture and then more hair? Oh, jeez. Well, there she goes. Oh, okay. She just went to sit downstairs. Well, you know, I'm gonna count- And stare at the blank television next to a, a Kanga from Winnie the Pooh, apparently. Why do we have that? 
count this as a blessing. I'm just glad she's not literally a corpse, even though she doesn't blink. But I'm just gonna leave her here because she looks rather busy right now. And besides, we have stuff to do on our own. We have a real estate empire to start. Well, let's take a quick jaunt around town, shall we? Here's our local bus stop, known as the home office, complete with a freestanding ATM, which would surely not get stolen instantly. Oh, and what's this hiding behind this vending machine? Is that the real estate agent office? I do believe that's me, I think. Hello? Is anybody home? Not a very good use of the space. And I don't know what's giving it away, but I feel like this is where the accountant sits. I mean, if we had one. Hiring an accountant reduces the tax rate you pay. I mean, I guess that could be theoretically true. We're gonna hire Aria because their shirt has a four on it, which must mean they're <laughs> numerically inclined. The new employee has been hired. She'll start tomorrow. Excellent. Can't wait to meet my employee for the first time. Oh my goodness. How long was I engaging the hiring process? I wish I knew what time it was, but now the time appears to be go home and sleep. Well, you don't have to tell me twice. Time to head back home where my door is still open and the missus is still watching TV. Well, but she's not though. But she's not though. Okay, so the actual story of this game is that your wife is possessed by a demon from hell. Um and she is going to kill you in your sleep. Um and they, but not until you've made some money because the demon has grown accustomed to a certain level of comfort. Um so so as soon as you make some money you, uh, one day she's gonna kill you in your sleep and just take it all. That's what's gonna happen. Well, good night. Time to go to bed alone, sleeping on top of the covers as usual. Ah, good morning. I see you're doing some work on the computer. Looks really- Again? Nope. <laughs> no, she's not! Really important. Oh, sorry, I startled you. You know, it didn't even occur to me. Can I talk to her? Where is she? Oh, sorry, I didn't realize you were so engaged doing the dishes. You know, we never talk anymore. How have you been? Hello, how are you? I'm fine, you? I'm good, I miss you. We have some amazing options here considering we just got up. Love, I'm going to bed. Can you give me some money? I have something on my mind. I think I know which one we're going with. Of course, my love, I've got $1,079. Thanks, my love. No need for a joint bank account. Wait, can I just keep doing that? Can I have some more money, please? Please. I'm afraid, my love, I don't have any money. Aw, oh, too bad. I'll I'm afraid, my love, I don't have any money. Yes. Also, what's with these weird envelopes you call pockets? Anyway, th that's just female fashion, baby girl. Like, that is just what happened. They give you this nonsense, and it's like you can barely fit a chapstick in there. Like, useless. So many things. Or just sometimes you just have a little flap. That looks like it maybe was supposed to be a pocket, but like it's literally just a flap that's sewn onto your pants somewhere. You can't even put a chapstick in that. None of them are big enough for a credit card. Like, we're not going to turn this into a rant about women's pants because they suck. Thanks for the money. Sorry to disturb you. Have fun doing your tippy toe dance back to the couch. How come she never goes in here? What is this room for? This must be the bathroom, right? Or not. This must be the room exclusively for crying. Okay, Josh, stop getting so distracted. Or else the NYPD is gonna catch on to you. There's real estate to be made. Hello, employee whose name I already forgot. How are you doing today? Wow, they really improved those MacBook keyboards, didn't they? And when I hit E, really my only options are to fire her or not talk to her at all. Because I either have to dismiss her, hire somebody else, or just walk away and say nothing. Okay, thanks for working. I'll just be over here at my desk with these two weird interrogation chairs facing each other. <laughs> either way, time to enjoy my daily newspaper. Oh, never mind. No, I'm not. <laughs> I can't read. I don't have any talent in reading. <laughs> Oh, no. Uh, for that, you need talent. <laughs> yeah, you're right. It looks like we don't have that talent. Also, do, like, okay, maybe, maybe, ooh, maybe that's why the wife is, like, doing her work on a blank screen and, like, looking at their blank screen. Because, like, look at this newspaper. There's, like, nothing in the center of the newspaper. There's nothing on the front fold. There's only stuff written on the side. So maybe we can only see certain things. Like, we can only see what's on this side, but somebody who has actual talent will be able to see the whole paper. Yeah, it looks like we don't know how to read yet. I'm sorry, wife, I failed you. Okay, well, let's go ahead and just... Never mind, it's the end of the day again. I've got to stop getting so distracted or we're never going to sell any houses. And before we go out for the day, let's say hello to our wife. And by that, I mean ask if she has any more money, which <laughs> miraculously she does. So we're going to take her $602. Was that suitcase of money just hers and we took it? I can't help <laughs> but feel like something shifty is happening. Okay, anyway, let's see. Let's look at the computer here. Oh. 
Did you make any money today? Can I have it? Well, this is entirely too many icons. Ooh, let's check our mail. Today is the day for Storage Wars. You must visit. <laughs> well, you have to tell me twice. Hold down the fort. I'm going out. Okay, well, I guess that's this over here. Let's check it out. Hello, fellow robots. What are we doing today? Oh, you're the ticket man, huh? What do I do? Do I just put the $100, like what, right in your mouth? Here you go. <laughs> Ah, I see. It looks like that started the simulation. Nice swagger. <laughs> ah, there we go. Everyone's awake and ready to fight over cargo containers. So if I recall, they're basically auctioning off mystery goods. I'll make a bid with my wife's money of 817, please. And really all I want is for everyone else to not have these. And it looks like we've succeeded. And now we're just gonna rinse and repeat. I'm just slamming the offer increase button so that anytime anyone else tries to bid, my hand goes up actually faster than theirs does. Oh, my character's so awkward. Okay, and another one belongs to us. Oh, we're gonna do this again, are we? I don't know why you bother. You know how this is gonna go. And the auction starts when I walk into this circle. Can I just stare at them while we do the auction? Oh yeah, the answer is yes. What a power move, right? You're just staring <laughs> at the other people so they know they can't have it. And that's apparently how auctions are won. And then they all just swagger off into the void. Except the door guy. He goes into standby <laughs> mode. And of course, as I leave this space, my eyes are immediately drawn to this dealership. But I gotta pace myself. I can't spend my wife's money all in one place. No. Although, she can't possibly be upset if I buy this beauty, can she? I mean, look at it. It's crappy and has flames. And it's only, oh, 54,000. Well, fiddlesticks, it's just gonna have to wait. Wait, what am I talking about? The solution's been in front of us all along. Hello, darling wife of mine. I'm out of money. Can you give me some hey. money? Again? I only have $211. Correction, had $211. Now, now, don't get too comfortable. I'm just gonna keep asking for more money. I don't have any money right now. Come back later. Well, maybe we she is like an ATM. Good lord. We just need to wait till she gets up to do something else. Hello, wife of mine. I had another question for you. Actually, I have two questions. Why isn't this your portrait anymore? This is clearly <laughs> Isabella, who I obviously did not select from the wife catalog. You know what? Whatever. <laughs> did you make money today? Can you give it to me? Still no money. Okay, so it seems likely that I just need to wait for the next day to come around, since I have now asked her for money in all of her favorite places to be, and she claims she doesn't have any. That's fine. I'll just wait till the next day. Time to go to sleep at 5.30 p.m. <laughs> ah, another day. Good morning, portrait of not my wife, which speaking of, you know what time it is. Ah, there we go. Our in-house ATM is open for business again. Thank you. And rinse and repeat. What do you mean I can't go back to sleep at 11 a.m.? Well, time to just keep hitting the button till it lets me. Staring at my bed until 5 p.m. on the dot and back. He didn't even go to work. <laughs> this is okay. I don't know why I'm surprised. Back to it. Give me money. Thank you. And while I stand here staring at my bed, I can't help but wonder what this meter does at 13%. But since it keeps counting down, I guess we'll find out soon. After I, It looks like a steak, so you probably have to eat something. Another nice night's rest. Rise and shine, me. Well, I'm at 0% and nothing seems to be happening. You know, I'm starting to think this meter doesn't do anything, which is fine by me. Anyway, back to the money-making venture. And then before you know it, we have extracted from our wife the amount required. All 54,000. Wow. How long do you think that took? That must have taken ages. You know what? I, it's like, it's very funny to me that he does things like this to make the money when it's like, this definitely took longer than doing the simulation like, than making money the way you're supposed to in the game. And look at that, our relationship status has never been stronger. A whopping 5%. Oh boy, how I can't wait to purchase the automobile of my dreams. Hey, wait a minute. You're not the car of my dreams. Definitely not the price of my dreams. So be it, I guess I'm leaving empty handed. And while I could be sad as I wander down the street, it turns out it might have been for the better. What in tarnation is this? A horse stable, huh? And great news. We can buy a horse, and I'm glad it gives me all this information, but all I really care about is the price, and that price is right. So come on, horse. Serial killer dork ready for his first oh time on God. a horse. Ye that looks wrong. He looks too big for this horse. The proportions are incorrect it looks like yeah we're free oh my god i can't believe the game lets us that do this better. can we really spend the entire rest of the game just using a horse i don't see why not Ooh, in a casino and it looks like we can <laughs> excuse me i am busy <laughs> trying to bask at the casino could you not shove me yeah see even my horse is annoyed gosh what a jerk anyway where was i all oh, right time for the casino in we go
Uh, <laughs> I wasn't actually ready for it to let us walk in with the horse. Well, I it's wasn't a casino, either. all right. Some lady dancing on the coffee table. But more importantly, look at this distinguished clientele. That's the way to sit, what? sir. Well, if you'll excuse me, everybody, I'm gonna go over here and play the tables. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Alley-oop. Okay, there we go. Hey, dealer, I want to play. You know, it always feels like a good sign when the dealer themselves is crying at the table. Okay, well, hold on, lady. I'm trying to park my horse. And dismount. There we go. Now I'm ready to play some blackjack. So we'll just saunter up to the table and... and oh, God, what's my horse doing? Whatever, time to bet 10000 So let's just play a quick round. Oh, that was easy. I made $10,000. This is a much better use of my wife's oh. money. Why not just bet it all on one hand? This will work out in my favor for sure. Yeehaw! And for you usual in games like this. The key to making tons of money is not in the game title. It's at the casino. Isn't that right, my award-winning horse? In fact, you wait right here. I'm gonna go see if I can buy some more horses. Hello. How would you like to be my second horse purchase? Nice stats, don't care, must buy. And also must this buy. one. Good price, sweet ride probably. And you as well. Okay, great, now I own all the horses. Not sure what I'm gonna do with four horses, but what do I care? In the meantime, I'm just gonna leave him in the street and hope that- Oh, excellent. I didn't know horses could block these cars. This is the greatest gift of all time. Anyway, you two just... Don't mind me, officer. We're just, you know, doing a thing. <laughs> Thanks for not caring. I'm gonna okay. sell... I, I really did think he was gonna get, like, the police was gonna be like, you can't do that or something. You know, like, in The Sims, if you let your baby cry too long, Sims CPS comes and gets the child away from you. So it's like, it's possible to have consequences... I thought maybe this would happen, but no. Celebrate by taking a dip in the neighbor's pool. Uh oh. Whoa. 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 <laughs> I just want to put my horse in the pool. And then for just a quick little uneventful dip, and then back out we go. Just a little bit of struggle. Okay. <laughs> Wonderful recovery. Anyway, back to making money. Uh, good to see all the regulars here. Okay, two horses down, looking good. And let's play. Oh, oh god. We've got everything we need right here. We've got this weird twitching hoof. We've got an entire <laughs> horse blocking my view. And just at the very edge of frame, we have the dealer still crying. Here, let me back up from the table and try this again. As you can see, this horse in the back is still in the flying motion now. Why can't you be more like that? Why can't you be more like that and be out of my way? Oh, there, there we go. Is. Perfect. Okay, Thanks. let's go ahead and bet all of our money and then play us some sick blackjack again. And before you know it, millionaire. Hey, you know Woo! what's cooler than a million? 194 million. And you know what's even cooler than that? 1.5 billion dollars. And even wow. though I haven't been home, our relationship is healing. Anyway, I think now we have to ask because now you're not asking her for money every day because you're, uh, you're, you're just taking it from the casino instead. Ask ourselves the basic question. As I throw down $1.5 billion in chips onto the table, is there a limit to how big this number can get? And I do believe there's only one way to find out. So hold, please. And it turns out the answer is yes. Yes, there is. For me, it's $3.2 Because at a point, the table just stops letting you bet. No idea why. It's not like we bankrupt the casino or anything. How do you think it's got to feel to be this guy? Watching some <laughs> other person come in here, sit down, make several billion dollars, and then get on his trusty steed and ride <laughs> off into the night. All that while dressing like this. Oh, and hey, it turns out we didn't actually need to buy a car. We own one already. I just didn't stop to look. And what a beauty it is, too. We'll be sure to inspect that more once we've had a good night's rest. There we go, another successful dismount. Well, good night, horse. This doesn't look weird <laughs> at all. And like always, slept like a dream. Oh, wow, look, our relationship is doing much better. You can tell by the 92%, but also that her picture is back. Maybe that's why it switched. Don't worry, though, we're still <laughs> gonna ask her for money every day. I mean, that's over $2,000 I'm not turning down. Okay, let's check out this beast. Well, it's a thing. It's got seating for two and all kinds of space in the back for transporting things. But why do that when it's time to get in the car? Okay, here we are in our winner's vehicle. Whoops. Oops. My apologies, officer. This won't be a problem, will it? Nah, it's fine. We don't care. We don't care about anything. Why, thanks, officer. That's mighty kind of you. Although I can't really seem to shake myself loose. Hang on, I got a solution for this. Good thing the dealership is right here, and the crash happened all the way over there. 50 <laughs> whole feet away. Hi, yes, I would like to buy this car because of the... Ro Ooh, it's like... Sci-fi. Movie. Ugh, weird. Weird with the moving paint. Rorschach paint job and the Oh yeah, that okay, that is the word I was looking for. Rorschach, like the watchman guy. Bluely excessive spoiler. Finally, we can be the proud owners of a BWM. Okay, let's go rescue our much worse car. 
Ow. Let's, uh, <laughs> let's pretend you didn't see that, okay? Okay, great. Where was I? Oh, hey, let's activate this to help nudge us off. Yeehaw! Here we go. Nice. Okay, great. That about did it. Ooh, and more horses to buy. This is great. <laughs> Come here, you. Join my horse army. Oh, yeah. You guys get in the street with your friends. Well, now we're provided with a difficult question. Which vehicle do we take? Old Sensible or this monstrosity? Yeah, definitely this, monstrosity. this embarrassment of a car. Come on, fellas. Let's go to the suburbs and do the real estate thing or whatever this game claims we're supposed to be doing. Okay, so let's see. How do we even find what houses are for rent? You know what? I can't put my finger on it, but I think I cracked the code. I think I figured out how to tell who's looking for a real her. All right, well, I'm probably not what you're looking for, but something tells me you don't have the qualifications to care. I know I don't. I want... And it's like, dude, look at the car I'm driving. You know I can do you good, right? To hire a professional estate agent. The price for one month is only 40930 I don't understand what any of that means. And while I could do stuff like haggling, I have so much money that I just don't care. So it's a deal. I am buying it. Not even going to read all these stats. Thank you. It belongs to me now, I think. Ah, oh, fiddlesticks in the sun went down instantaneously again. Well, time to go home, I guess. Pardon me, horse. Or Sorry. come along for the ride. Always wanted a horse co-pilot. And they look so happy happy. Okay, horse friend, wait right here. Just hang on to the hood while I go cry myself to sleep. Okay, good morning. Where were we? Off to check out our rental, that's what. Okay, and I believe it's this one over here on the right. Oh, oh, ma'am, hello. I'm just backing up into this space. Everything here feels very, very I love that that's not even a space. Very normal. Okay, anyway, so here is our rental. Before we even open the door, we can see that it's got a dirty value of 81%, and it claims we can rent it for as high as $6,000? Well, I don't feel like that makes sense, but what do I know? Let's not judge it until we see it. Oh, yeah, look at this premium property. Look at all this goodness in one single frame. Bugs, blood, oh and beer. And if we go up and pick up stuff, we actually gain... Bugs, blood, and beer. Sounds like my kind of place. And skill points, which applies to all this skill tree stuff, I guess. So you can do oh. stuff like buy land to build houses on. And the thing we've been missing, being able to read the newspaper at all. Anyway, no need to worry about that. For now, I think we need to hide the murder that happened in here. And it turns out we have like a wheel of things we can do. Oh, like the sponge. And I'm going to assume that this is how you clean this stuff or just wave to it. Oh, I wasn't close enough. Okay, <laughs> I'm sorry. Here's the deal I'm going to make with this place. I'm going to clean two of these blood stains. But just to show that we mean business, we're going to leave this one right here. It's a reminder to pay your rent. And how do we deal with this? We can't just wash these away, can we? Of course not. That's what this is for. <laughs> the insecticide. Oh. Yep, something tells me this goes to that. Just like this. Oh yeah, look at that dirty value just melting away. Oh, and it looks like this can is infinite too. Hi ma'am, I just wanted to introduce myself. I'm the new neighbor. Nice to meet you. And if we head upstairs, why is this place nicer than my place? Can I just move in here? This place even has three floors. Wow. All right, I guess I should do the thing where we add furniture. But golly, where do we get it? What, you think that guy knows? I can just ask him. Hey, you. Hello, Kevin. What's the hey, latest hey. news in town? I just arrived. I don't know much. I'm definitely not a hitman. Okay, thanks for the info. On your way, sir. Oh, and hey, look, our neighbor's also trying to sell their house. Well, I wish the best of luck to wait a minute. <laughs> The identical twins here they're even wearing the same shirt and is that you what about that guy <laughs> that guy looks just like you though ah never mind that i think i see oh and that guy the guy in the suit is walking like edgar from men in black something more important i don't know what you're doing with all this furniture but how about i take it off your hands you're not gonna mind that right well you don't seem to and the moment we walk into our house we can just place it here okay so let's go ahead and place this chair have it face the wall like that yes yeah. Okay, how many much do you want to bet he's going to start piling it on top of itself as soon as he can? Let's increase the rental value and then head back over to our neighbor's house to steal more of his furniture. Ugh, you know what? This is going to take forever. So it looks like we're going to be using this thing after all. Pardon me, sir steals a lot coming through. Okay, don't mind me. Whoops. That's ah, fine. It was free to begin with. Okay, and we'll just add all this stuff to storage. dum de dum no big deal. Pardon me, horse friend. And here we are, making this place an even bigger mess than before. Are we ever going to find out what was in those storage containers he bought? Four. Okay, let's get these chairs in. One for each corner. Oh, and definitely okay. a chair right here. Got to be able to admire the blood stain. There's also no room for your knees, so you're going to have to really straddle that thing. Oh my <laughs> god, and this is a premium crying spot. Who wouldn't want to be tucked away back there? Well, I've done all I'm willing to do. Okay, great, excellent. What do we do now? How do we rent this? Hey, dog, help me. How do I get a tenant in here? <gasps> Gasp, you can pet the dog? Well, yes, what are we waiting yeah. for? You need a talent? No! Bag? 
too. I'm surprised I can even breathe on my own or walk on my own. Although it's debatable if anybody knows how to do that. Oh, I found it in the skill menu. Dog house. You can build a home to tame a dog. You can now build a dog house in front of your house. This dog house will become a home for your pet. And it requires 50 experience, which I don't have yet. Which means we have to stare at this dog, but not pet them. This is pure torture. Well, let's head back to the office. After all, maybe that's where we go to manage our properties. Hello, dutiful accountant. Ooh, I just now noticed her feet don't even touch the ground. I feel like there might be a problem with the model size. Anyway, whatever, I'll be- Look, look how tiny she is compared to the chair. Over here managing my apartments, I hope. Wait, I'm getting distracted by this button over here that says office design. What does this do? Oh my god, I think this is literally the same template as another game I've played. A game called Car for Sale, where you can do the exact same stuff. So first, let's change the signboard. I don't care realty. Oh yeah, it looks perfect. In fact, let's yep. just make the text even bigger and add some additional spacing. And then, yep, there we go. Double perfect. All that for $100. I like how it's so big, the lettering is literally in the way. What a dominating player in the industry. Okay, that's great and all, but I actually still don't know how to do the whole rental thing. Is it here in home information? Okay, this looks like the place. Number of days left to deliver the house to its owner. 25 days. So I'm trying to get it rented on behalf of the owner. Yes, that's right. I'm figuring this out nearly 20 minutes into the video. Still don't know how to do that though, but I'm sure we'll figure it out. Whoops. Looks like I've got another friend. I like that some of the cars, like it's the, the horses stop entirely some of them it just shoves them forward and then some of them it just picks up and carries them on its hood okay that's as far as you wanted to go so be it how oh, nice. do i rent this stupid house over in my little wheel thingy i do also have a tablet oh wait i figured it out go to web and then you're presented with this thing which again looks surprisingly similar to the car selling menu in the game car for sale okay let's see let's rent this place i just want it rented so we're gonna make it for the price of one dollar uh oh and i'm gonna need a photo oh good and it's nighttime now let's go ahead and get that perfect photo. <laughs> okay, that's one photo down. And let's go ahead and get one more. And there we go. I'm trying to decide which one would be worse. This incredibly dark one of the horse or this incredibly dark one with the blood stain. Or I can just do the blood one three times. Yeah, okay, there we go. The ultimate rental. Come live in this murder mansion. And now let's head home and get a nice night's rest. Oh boy, I'm so excited to go to sleep. Ah, the sleep of victory. Hopefully we'll wake up and the place will be rented. Fiddlesticks, no one's bought it yet. I'm sure we'll figure it out. Actually, wait, you know what? The auction is open today. Let's go check that out again. I don't actually have any idea what happened to the stuff we bought before, but I figure we're rich now, so we'll just buy more stuff. Come on, this car's gotta fit, right? Maybe if I get a running start. Oh no, that's oh, no. not what I wanted. <laughs> Sir, are you trying to steal my horse? Hey horse, stop them. See, that'll teach you. You know what? Fine. We'll just take the horse in there. Oh, and good. I can do it while on a horse. That's nice. And I'll just place a bid of, whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell is this number? Why would I bid this? And how is someone bidding more? Whatever. I still won. It only costs like a billion dollars. Wait a minute. What is my accountant doing here? Nothing about this feels on the level. And after we win all these, we're going to have to figure out what this container delivered to our home looks like. Oh, well, shiver me timbers. There they are. Four cargo okay. containers full of mystery goods. So, like, shouldn't the other ones have been arrived as well? Like, we'd... We should have eight, right? Let's take a look. Ah, yes, very dignified slide right <laughs> off the back. Okay, let's open the first one. Wow, what a haul. I'm glad- I bought- I bought a little candle thing for a billion dollars. We paid over a billion dollars for this. Well, we'll get back to this because it's almost bedtime. And sleep and wake. And back to it. And they're gone. Well, I guess we'll never know, will we? Once there's another auction, we'll just buy some more. Thank God money means nothing to us. Wait, what the heck is happening here? Why is everybody crowding around my place? Is there like a dead body or something? What do you guys know that I don't know? Oh, well, that's not what I expected. Is this the property I'm selling? Why is it in like a snow globe? Does this mean you guys want to buy? Oh, just came here to look, I get it. Wait, I can actually just move this thing around? So clearly I can move it all around my proper... No, I can't. It has to stay outside. I guess the reason you can move this thing around is theoretically you may have more than one property for sale. Well, hang on. Before we rent that place out, let's head back over to that house and make sure that whatever lucky tenant gets this place, they have a nice surprise waiting for them. I know I'd like that. Hello, prospective... The dirty value went up again because you put a horse in there. Buyers, who would like to rent the place? I guess I'm renting to you because you're highlighted. Just kidding, I guess I'm not. Hello, lady. I'm angry that I waited. Good, I'm glad. I'm sorry, how can I help you? I want to rent the house in advertisement for 10 days. Nobody would do that, but okay. Ha ha ha, this is so cheap. Give me the keys quickly. Okay, we did it. Let's head over there and see if they've already moved into their new place.
It does feel like an Airbnb kind of deal, doesn't it? Anyways, I'm glad this whole time this dog is still here. Just desperately alone. Okay, let's see how things are looking inside the house. Well, the horse is still there. There's garbage still there. But all the furniture I put down, not there. And they put a different stain on the wall. I am just outraged. Well, the front door is locked, but I'm wondering if there's a way for us to get into the house so I can get my horse back. And by that, I mean if I just get this vehicle right up against the wall. When I open the door, will it just clip me into the building? Out we go. Oh, yeah, that works great. Here I am right in the building. And now the front door is wide open. I don't agree with these new tenants. Oh, well, either way, at least we got our horse. Although I'm not quite sure how to get out, but I think we can figure this out. Imagine looking at your window and this is what you see. Okay, and it looks like we're breaking through. Oh, we did it. It's like the house gave birth to us. Oh, wait, this is awkward. I think I just needed to wait a day. Howdy, ma'am. I think I'm here to collect the rent or something. I don't know. Hello. Hello, did you prepare the rent? Here is the rent. Thank you. You have gained five skill points. Does that mean you're moved in now? Absolutely not. I was holding out hope that you would put furniture or something, but now I know. Drug den it is. You may be a paying tenant, but it doesn't mean I can't still disagree with your decisions. Well, the good news is now we have 61 XP, which means we can unlock this doghouse thing. Please, God, tell me I can pet you. You have to buy a doghouse. I'm so sorry. I know you want to be pet so bad, but I'm legally back. not allowed to. Oh, okay. I see where it's supposed to go. Okay, how do I build this? Oh, I see. I build it with money, of course. Well, that's easy enough. Oh, good. It comes with a mess of kibble and everything. God, now I have to go... I like that the kibble looks like baked beans. All the way back. Can I just climb in myself? Well, it's almost sleepy time, so I'm gonna go back to sleep before we head back over there. Okay, let's go make a new friend. Wait a minute, why are you still out here? Is there something wrong with the property? Here you are. I came to take the rent. Here is the rent. Wait a minute. We have to collect the rent every day? What the hell kind of crap is this? Who lives this way? Who wears this much denim? God, whatever. Let's just make a new friend. Hello, dog. I would like to pet you now. You have tamed the dog. And now you can name the dog. Let's get ultra creative with this one. Dog. Well, now we have dog following us. Okay, come on, Good. dog. We're almost yes, home. Come, come, okay, go buddy. ahead. Get in. Oh, I see. You don't actually use it. You just resume doing this somewhere else. And we also get this really stupid sign. <laughs> yes, warning dog. Do not pet. I love that. That's amazing. Unless you have that talent. Oh, and you know what's really exciting? From the time I last opened the game until now, there's suddenly a farm across the street. Oh, early access, you're so wild. Finally, I can be a free-range psychopath. If only I could figure out where the barn is. Oh, hey, and hello. Hi, what are you doing here? Do you own this farm? Yes, but I'm too old for that. I'm thinking of selling the farm soon. I believe that's what they call foreshadowing. What I mean is I'm sure once we find a way to off him, we can have his farm. I don't know. Judging by your house, you seem pretty ready to leave now. Just say the word and I'll give you a helping hand. Well, now I'm curious what happens when we reach the end of our rent agreement. Because it says here the agreement ends in three days. So let's see what happens when it runs out. Okay, that faithful day is upon us. It's move out day. I'm here to collect the rest of the rent. And where are they? Oh, I see they're gone. But at least my chairs are back. Okay, I see now. I still have the house. I have 12 more days to rent it out. And the previous tenant is just gone. Okay, now I'm actually a little bit curious. What is the maximum rent we can get for this place? Like, if we actually right. spend the time to clean everything up, get the dirty value down all the way, and instead of using using this crappy furniture I stole. We go ahead and just get rid of this crap. Head on over to this lovely store, where as you can see, we can buy all kinds of furniture. Talk to the automaton claiming He's trying. This is something very strange and different. I'm not used to this. To be a human being. And let's see, what is the most expensive thing we can buy? Which appears to be this PC, because of course it is. So we're just gonna keep buying these over and over and over oh. again. And I spoke way too soon. Let's see, where are my purchases? Where can I pick them up? This is where you sell, which I guess means that... Oh, hey, yeah, there they are. Well, now I feel like this pile's kind of embarrassing. Hi, I'm back. I'd like to buy more of these, please. Okay, yeah, that's more like it. What an amazing pile of gaming PCs. God, I love a good mountain of crap. What do you think, <laughs> officer? That pile of PCs is sick, bro. Thank you, I feel the same way. That, and I'm sure you noticed, but it's doing great things to the frame rate. Whoa, guys, can you just wait, please? Look what you did. Now there's high-end PCs all over the pavement. <laughs> Sorry, bro. The nerve of some people just not letting me do my job. Jeez, just let me be a real estate agent at five frames a second. Okay, so before we started, this was the average range for renting. And here it is with the computers. Wow, what okay. a stark difference. You mean to tell me someone's going to be willing to pay <laughs> upwards of 26000 to 32000 I mean, if they're mining Bitcoin in here, probably. Sounds right to me. Okay, let's try to get the perfect picture of this woman crying at the casino. 
There we go. Perfect shot. And based on what I heard, let's go for a daily rental value of 30000 which it claims is right between cheap and expensive. And place the ad. Oh boy, I can't wait to see how people appreciate the property now. Ah, a fellow horrible dresser. I want to rent the house in advertisement for nine days. Rent amount is 30000 a day. This price is high for me, but I accept it. Good, we all win. Enjoy your gaming setup for 45 people. Well, that feels nice and easy to do that. It almost feels like we don't even need to do the gambling thing. I was texting, I'm sorry. Anyway, there's one last thing I think we need to try out and see what it's all about. See that for sale sign? That's so we can buy this whole plot of land and build our own house on it. Based on everything I've seen, I'm sure this will be really in-depth. So let's start by buying the land. Ooh, and look at this. There's so many different styles of houses we can choose from. And we're gonna choose this one here because it has a garage. Whereas all the rest of these hasn't garage. So let's do it. Ready to work. Wow, you got started already? Oh, so this is how houses are built. A bunch of cyborgs and construction vests just orbit at the property for a while, while the entire house slowly beams in over time. Oh, and I bet all the neighbors love them. Now that it's nighttime and they're like, nope, we're on a schedule. If I don't hammer these pallets, who will? And then before you know it, done. okay, it looks like the work is done as all the workers just leave down the street and into the abyss. Congratulations <laughs> on your construction. I must return to my home planet now. Good day. He looks like Mark Zuckerberg. <laughs> cool. And now we have yet another rental property. How lucky we are. Also, huge fan of my garage. Is that what we're calling the backyard now? Hey, wife, good news. I bought some property and built a house on it. No, we can't move in. Yeah, I didn't think you'd care. And I'm going to try to ignore how there's one knife missing from this knife block. Don't worry. I told you. She's gonna kill you now that you have money. Hey wife, you're not gonna have to worry about this anymore. I discovered a bug where if you get on and off the horse, at some point your guy just disappears. Or as I like to call it, we've become the horse. So the hell with all of this needless construction work. I'm just gonna head over to this farm, maul this guy to death and take over his farm, and everybody wins. I wanna thank Displayed again for sponsoring this video. Go ahead and check them out for some sweet Black Friday deals. So I hope you had fun, I know I did. And I'll see you next time. All right. Absolute bonkers, as always. But that's why we like these videos, isn't it? Just because it's always absolutely nuts. It's just fun. It's just fun. Uh, and I get to learn about all sorts of weird games that I will never, ever play. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I did. I, I always enjoy the Let's Game It Out videos. Um, so I hope you had fun. Uh, make sure that you show Josh some love. I'm giving them a little bit of a thumbs up. Go check out that display thing. That looks cool. It's in the longer Black Friday, but I'm sure they still have cool stuff. Um, let me know what I should react to next. Don't forget to subscribe and like here as well. And don't forget, we also have shot glasses in the store in the description box below. So, you know, we got like a little, little Chicago Reacts one. We have one for the anime channel. We've got four of them, like lots of fun little shot glasses. Make sure you go ahead and check those out. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.